I'm here at Stingray City in Antigua where I'm going to swim with the stingrays. Now this is a great way to cool off and connect with nature. Goldwyn, so I understand I'm going to have an opportunity to swim with the stingrays. I've never done that before. What can I expect? Well, firstly, out of the bat, you can expect to be amazed, <laughs> knowing that you're going to be in the middle of the ocean, having around 30 to 50 southern stingers swimming all between your legs, rubbing up against you just like cats and dogs. So, you know, off the bat, you're going to be very much amazed. And it's a wonderful place to bring the entire family, so it doesn't matter what age you are, right? I tell you, my son comes here when he was about two months. Wow. So, you know, we start from, from a baby. Stingrays are rather harmless. That is so true, sir. They're very much harmless. They are just like cats and dogs. You know, it's just getting to know them and knowing that these guys can actually come up to you, swim next to you, and do you no harm. And I'll be able to actually feed them, right? Yeah. Um, strangely thing about the feeding, though, these guys, they like um, a vacuum. <laughs> Food just about three inches away from their mouth, and they can actually suck it up from that distance. It's a great way to really connect to nature, it's right? It's a great way to connect to nature, knowing that you can be in the middle of the ocean, and having a big fish in your arms. So not only can you pet them, hold them, but you can feed them you can as well. You also get a chance to feed them. Don't do me, I kiss them though. You kiss them, okay. <laughs> now this is my ideal way to take in the rays. I'm picking up some souvenirs because this was an experience of a lifetime. You definitely have to try it. <laughs> 